Hello everybody, it's Rick Sisman, it's Matt Cat Sphere, and I'm here with a video to demonstrate how I make this ping pong ball act like a side wheel, what wrapping my hands around it. Now it's going to move a little bit, right there. And what it is is that there's a black liner on it, and I put the ping pong ball on my cell phone, which has a very ultra smooth screen on it, glass screen. And I used the foil the last time, and I put this ping pong ball, and I wrap my hands around it, and you can see it's rotating around with the black line on it. It's spinning around in circles. This ping pong ball, just like a side wheel would, I'm wrapping my hands around it to, so it could be affected by my chi energy. And see it moved right there. And that's because it's spinning around so much that it just has to move to the left or right. And that's exactly what we want, drastic movement. But uh, it, it may look like my fingers are touching it, but it's not. It's just a bad angle, so I just want to put it out there. But the thing is, though, is that I'm very excited because um, I'm going to try to see if I can find a, a certain type or 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 a grade of glass that my cell phone uses so that I can use it to practice with more. And what I recommend too is getting this white ping pong ball. Um, you can get uh, these, see this is gonna spin a lot right here. It's gonna spin a lot. It's all from my chi energy from my hand, just like a side wheel, it's spinning around on the glass. Once in a while it'll move to the left to the right. But what I recommend is um, getting uh, the, the Dollar Tree ping pong balls. You can get like six of them for one dollar. And this is the one I got. And this one is because it's lighter and it's smoother because it's, it's cheap, but it's very light and smooth. And what I also recommend is um, using your new cell phone and having to just give it a try with your cell phone. It may it may work or it may not work. It may work or may not. But but with my older cell phones, it didn't work. With this one, it just does. What I'm going to try to do is I'm going to try to look into trying to get the specific glass used on my cell phone so that I can use it and practice with it and maybe share with you guys that piece of glass or try to give you information how to get it but i'm pretty sure there's higher end more polished glass out there that will react better and we could mess around with all types of objects on it, like rolling cans and all that and what i also recommend is um right here this is the this is a little bit more expensive one i bought from walmart and it's kind of heavy and it's not as smooth as the cheap ones the white ones that you saw so this one doesn't react that well but you can see that it's rotating because of the print on it and it's going to move a lot left to the right and stuff like that. But what I recommend is um, when you get a ping pong ball and you put it in your cell phone, make sure your cell phone is very smooth and doesn't have no scratches. Give this ping pong ball a little uh, spin, not a hard one, just a little nudge. When you put the ping pong ball on your screen, it's going to spin by itself automatically if your screen is smooth like mine. When I put my ping pong ball on the screen, it just smooth, it spins a little bit. And then I just go with it and wrap my hands around it. And there you go, guys. I want to share that with you.